Hey, we're here at NAM with Demetrio from iConnectivity. They've got some awesome products. I happen to have recently purchased the iConnect MIDI, which now runs my whole MIDI studio. So, uh, Demetrio, tell us about your product line. iConnect MIDI is our first one out of the box, and uh, uh, it's been doing really well. It's, it's central to a lot of people's studios, just like yours, Steve. Um, you can plug anything MIDI into it. Uh, they can talk to each other without a computer, but if you wanted to, you could plug in two iOS devices or a Mac and PC, and it's available uh, through standard USB, and it can, it's, it's visible through all the major software, Digital Performer, Cubase, all of those guys. How many MIDI devices can you get into your system with this uh, wonderful box? Well, there's 12 ports of MIDI. Two of those are computer and iOS devices, eight USB through a hub, and uh, however many you want to chain off of the DIN ports, which is two pairs of DIN ports on it. So I, I've been running my uh, iPad and my iPhone and my keyboard and just about everything, and it seems to be uh, the lowest latency device I've experienced with my, my iOS devices. Definitely low latency. Um, uh, iOS is uh, coming out. The iOS devices, we've got a lot of software that's available. Over 200 pieces of software now that are core MIDI compatible that you can download off the App Store. And uh, there have been some great software. We've been, we've been running a piece of software here called uh, Music Studio for, uh, for all of our demos, and it just works great for us. Um, out, off the App Store for 14 bucks, and it's got drum sounds, and it's got uh, bass and keyboard sounds. And we got it for $14 on here, and you can't beat that. We don't have to have a com we don't have to have a computing device um, with this. Here we've got a setup that has two USB um, MIDI devices, a, mic a Korg Micro Key and a Korg Nano Pad, and they're talking directly to this Roland JV1010. The Roland JV1010 just has DIN connectors on it, but we're using iConnect MIDI to do the gender changing between the USB MIDI connectors and the DIN connectors. And there's very, it's got very excellent response to it, even with drums, and you can really feel it with drums. It's it's so zero latency that it's very musical. Now, we can we can plug in several USB devices. I mentioned you can plug in eight USB devices through a hub. We've got five here that are connected to a USB hub. The hub's underneath the table here, and the hub's plugged into this USB or this iConnect MIDI. Um, iConnect MIDI is now connected to this iPad, and the iPad's generating all the sounds for us. And again, very excellent musical response through iConnect MIDI. And if there's anything that'll slow it down, it's not going to be iConnect MIDI. It's probably going to be the app that just needs a little tweaking. But uh, we've got some great apps already available in the App Store, some, some really high-end analog synthesizers that are available. So you've got a lot of choice and some very musical choices. Uh, our friend Jordan Rudis makes a lot of those very cool apps. Yeah, that's right. We've had him at CES with us, and he just did a great, uh, a great job uh, plugging his apps, but also working through iConnect MIDI with two iPads, and because we can handle that data throughput, he was he was laying down his uh, his controllers down on one, and the sounds coming out on one without a glitch. Right, and if anyone needs low latency, it's Jordan Rudis. It's Jordan Rudis. Yeah, he's the fastest hands in the business. So I hear you have an audio interface that you're introducing at this NAM show. That's right. We just uh, announced iConnect Muse. Now, what we did with MIDI, we're now doing with audio. iConnect Mi uh, Muse is a six stereo in, seven stereo out audio interface. It has uh, TRS balanced connectors running at 48K 24 bit conversion, but all the other inputs and outputs are digital. Again, we can plug in up to two iOS devices and Mac and PC. There's a USB uh, audio and MIDI uh, pass through port, as well as Ethernet doing AVB. And we can, one of the significant things about this is we can daisy chain several iConnect Muses to each other. So that can up your input and output counts. Now, with another significant thing about this is with the audio outputs, seven audio outputs, each one can have its own unique mix. So if you have a, your guitarist on one mix and you on another mix, your guitarist can have his own 
a lot, lots of guitar, and you can have a lot less guitar. So the independent mix is really important for this device. That sounds very cool. Well, I'm a big fan of your products, and uh, I have a feeling all of our users are going to be uh, big fans, too. I sure hope so. We're uh, really excited about our stuff, and we know they're useful for, for, the, for the musicians in the crowd and even the dabblers in the crowd who want to just try getting into it. Well, I connect MIDI rocks, and check out their website at iConnectivity.com.